So we're going to start with a Google search of Autodex for students. Okay, so on the Autodex website, click on Autodex Education and Student Access. So now that we're on the Autodex website, you have to navigate to the student section. So over there, you will see the available products and services. After taking a good look, you can navigate to the top right hand corner and click sign in. So you can see, take a very good look at all the services available um, on the website. But once you don't navigate to the top right hand corner, click on sign in. So on the next page, you have to pay attention to some very important things like the type of valid ID and then your type of um, type in your valid email address. Um, preferably, I would say type in your valid school email address. You can actually use any email address, but I would advise um, use your school email address because for the next steps, um, it will be much easier for you to use or do the next steps if you use a valid school email address. Because when I did my own verification, when I created my student um, Autodesk account, I discovered that using a valid um, student email address made everything much easier. It made the verification of my studentship a lot easier. So, type in your address and just fill in the um, survey or the details. Uh, click on um, sign in. So now you go click on done. Just wait for the redirecting back to the um, student section of the website. Now we have to navigate to get products. Scroll down and click on get products. Okay. So on the next page, you scroll down and locate Maya. So on this page, on this particular page that we're staring at, you see several Autodesk softwares. So these are all the softwares created by Autodesk. Scroll down, and click on Maya, and be mindful of the, of the Maya you click on. There are two Mayas there. So we have Autodex Maya 3D and we have Autodex Maya, I think LT. So we are looking for the one for 3D animation. So the next page, click next, click sign in. Since you've already created your account, now you have to verify your email address. So click guest verification email and then open a new tab, go to your um, email. If it's Gmail, fine. Then verify, click verify. Then go back to Autodex website and click done. You'll be redirected to, um, to the student section of the website. Now we have to do the same thing again. Scroll down, click get started. So we're progressing really well. Uh, wait for, for the next page to load. Okay, now sign in. Okay, now you're going to set up your educational details. So essentially what you want to do is fill in the details correctly as you have in your school documents so you'll be, you'll be, you may or may not be asked to upload. So we're going to start with the country. So I'm a Nigerian, so obviously I'm <laughs> a school in Nigeria too. I'm going to choose Nigeria, select student accounts then select my university level then the dates of um, you know admission and stuff like that yeah the duration when you expect to graduate blah 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 just fill in the details as correctly as possible especially as um, correctly as you have it in your school documents so on the next page Just fill in the name of your educational institution. Alright, so you have two things you can do here. 
type part of your educational institution and search then select the correct one or if you can't find it in the drop down you have to um, request for Autodex to add your school to the drop down so I could actually find mine University of Lawrence so I'll just continue select the year of admission and then the year expects graduates on the next page I'll click continue my account has been set so I have to continue to go back to the Autodex educational um, section of the website so I'm going to wait for it to load and then I'm going to click get started obviously I still need to con um, confirm my eligibility my educational status okay so on this next page I'm going to scroll down and read the information carefully but essentially I just want to confirm my um, my status as a student okay so identify services Ad identity services partnership by share ID click confirm I'm going to click confirm eligibility with your educational institution single signing so according to them they need more information before they can confirm my eligibility as a student and give me access to um, Autodex all right so all you have to do on this particular page is type in your designated your, your unique student um, email address and it will be verified by shareid.com with assistance I in, um, correctly inputted my institution my university my college institution all I have to do now is just to type the um, type the uh, email it already has the extension now click on get software on this page you see that my educational access to the product has been um, accepted and verified so i'm going to scroll down again and look for autodex maya like i said earlier we have two autodex maya maya lt and autodex maya 3d so we're not going to choose the lt we're looking for the 3d animation maya so once again these are all the um, autodex softwares available obviously you can actually get any one of these softwares for free as a student since you've confirmed your eligibility if you followed um the tutorial or the whole guidelines so now click on get products click on install so you have two options on install on the drop down you have to click you have to choose your language obviously <laughs> it's english for me so i'm going to choose my english and then choose the um, version i want and I'm going to choose my device. Uh, it's available on Windows, Linux, and Mac OS, obviously. Then click install. You have two options: either to install or to download. Okay, essentially, one would download everything once, while install will actually give you like uh, the installer. Yeah, so install will just download the installer. Why download? Will download all the files, like all the things. Uh, associated with software so i'm going to click install to just get installer because it's a lot uh, more economical in terms of data so next i'm going to after downloading after installing or downloading the install i'm going to click uh I'm f i'll find where uh, the installer has been downloaded on my device i'm going to click run as administrator okay so Essentially, what I want to do now is install the software correctly on my device. Okay, so just read up the um, read up everything and just fill in the correct details as required. You'll be required to sign in again. So obviously, using your school Gmail or school email address rather and voila you should be ready if you fill in all the details correctly as i've shown um by the time you get to this point autodex maya should be all yours for free so you're gonna get apps you're gonna get autodex maya for absolutely nothing you get it for free completely for free
if you follow my um, tutorial so thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my youtube channel